This one right here would taste really good on a, a top of a pie. pecan pie, on top of like a peach pie, or peach cobbler. <laughs> the people in the south are gonna shoot me dead. <laughs> peach cobbler. <laughs> the audacity. What is a peach pie? <laughs> Get a rope. <laughs> Shauna. And we're here for another vegan taste test Thursday. Ooh, what are we testing today, Bianca? Today we are testing ice cream. Oh, we didn't have such a good luck the last time, so I hope this one tastes better. Well, So Delicious has like some new brands. So I picked up two that I thought looked pretty darn tasty. Damn lights. Um, we have toasted coconut key lime. Ooh, that sounds good. And then I picked up, this one sounds tasty, but it also sounds like a really weird mix. This one is peachy maple pecan. Kind of like maybe like a peach cobbler? Yeah, I wasn't quite sure what to expect with it, but these two looked the best out of the brands that I saw at the store. Okay. So the entire container for this one is 700 calories. But you don't have to eat the entire container. You can if you want to. You can have a serving. There's three of them in here and they're 230 calories each. Okay, so going over there, what's what's going on as far as the... <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. This one has total fat, 13 grams per serving. Saturated fat, 12 grams. So basically the... This is pretty fattening. <laughs> but it's ice cream, so what do you expect? Um, no cholesterol, 10 milligrams of sodium, 28 grams of carbs, uh, 23 sugars, and 20 um, added sugars. So it's not natural from the fruit. It's something that they've <laughs> added into here. Yeah, but that's like a no duh. 700 calories for a pint. You know there's a lot of sugar in here. I mean, but I think that's pretty standard for ice cream, so I think we're good with that. And it's made with coconut milk, which is cool, not soy milk. And I like that. So we're going we're gonna to see how that tastes. Well, this is water. cashew milk, and the other one is coconut milk. So these have been sitting out for a while, so I think we should go ahead and just start testing them. So That's not what they look like. They've got a safety seal. I never know how I feel about safety seals. I tend to not like them, but then I'm upset when they're not there. Yeah, I kind of like safety seals because that means that nobody at the stores opened the package and looked at it. So this looks like ice cream. This doesn't smell like anything. This one smells like candy pecans. This doesn't smell like anything. That one you could smell a lot of the maple syrup in it. This one smells like my dish soap. Just a hint of lime. I think your dish soap is stronger. <laughs> See? Yeah. <laughs> it's a lighter version of my dish soap. They look like they've got a pretty nice consistency. Like I took these out of the freezer about half an hour ago and so they scoop really well. And uh, it looks like ice cream. All these lights suck ass. <laughs> and that's gross. It looks like ice cream, as you can see. Um, are we gonna eat it? Oh, uh, we're not gonna taste test this today. What we're gonna do is just look at it and tell you what we think of what it looks like. <laughs> so, it looks like ice cream. Um, it looks Don't blobby. Don't taste it. It looks blobby and liquidy. It's melty. It's, it's actually it's a nice- I'm melty. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually a nice consistency because I've had some vegan ice cream that's very it icy. Smells like pancake. All right, this is a very big serving, and Why did I'm you just gonna take go such for a big it. Bite. I just like swallowed it. I didn't even eat it. <laughs> you definitely um, taste the pecan and the maple. I didn't taste any peach. I taste the peach. I didn't. Maybe I should get a bigger bite, but it, it's very pecan-y. You know, that's what I like about this. It, you can really taste all the flavors. Like, mm, nothing's okay. overwhelming each other. I taste the peach. I taste, I taste the, the pecan. I taste the maple. It's all really nice. They're all just equally represented. And it also has little pecans in it. You can't see it because it's hidden in this ice cream. The consistency is great. It's There's not, a pecan there. It is not gritty. It mm -hmm. has a fresh flavor, so you don't feel like you're eating really, really processed, fake ice cream. It tastes mm -hmm. fresh. Um, it's got no bad aftertaste, which I'm thankful for because a couple of the vegan ice creams, we're not going to name any other names. Halo. 
but <laughs> a couple of the vegan ice creams have a really bad aftertaste. So this one had, it tastes great. Um, on the second bite, I did taste the peach, so maybe I just, because I had a big pecan in the first bite, that's what I tasted, but I really like it. Yeah, I'm a firm believer that ice cream should be like a treat, and so while Halo Top is like half the calories for the entire pint, it's not a treat. And so if I'm gonna eat ice cream, it's gotta be something like, that's a treat. So this is a treat. This is a great consistency. It's not gritty. It's very smooth. Very it tastes smooth. like yes. a regular ice cream. This is actually really, 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 really good. Two thumbs up on that flavor. Yeah, and I thought it was going to taste really I nasty. was like, when she said ice cream, I was like, oh, God, it's going to be gross. <laughs> All right, so let's taste the other one. That's how you wash your spoons. Yeah. I mean, when you're at home, right? So okay. this one is key lime, toasted coconut key lime. Now, key lime pie is my favorite, like, flavor before I went vegan for ice cream. There used to be a place called Brewster's here in the Dallas Fort Worth area, and they had a key lime pie ice cream, and I kid you not, I would go, like, every day to get some. I love lime, I love lemon, I love the flavor, I love key lime pie, so I'm really hoping this tastes good. It tastes like key lime meringue with an afterwash of coconut. It's a little fluffier, like, it, yeah, it tastes like the meringue part of the pie. Let's get into, like, where it's not defrosted. Okay, we're gonna get, like, a thick part of the ice cream. Okay, so that's less froofy because it's not defrosted, but it's, it's less, good. It's less it tastes flavorful. like key lime pie. I like the coconut flakes. Yeah, there's actual coconut flakes in there. I like that, too. I can taste all the flavors, but the lime is a bit too muted. I love a key lime pie that's sharp and that you taste that like tartness. Tartness from the lime. And yeah, this is missing that. It's missing the tartness. Um, even with the coconut, if you did toasted coconut instead of doing like the tartness for um, the tartness and the toasted coconut would taste really good. In the peak in the peachy maple pecan, all the flavors were really strong. And in this one, they're all very muted. Mm -hmm. So if you're someone who kind of likes something just so you know, maybe like a, a scoop with something else. This would be good because it's not going to overpower something else, but it doesn't have that bang that you're looking for with that flavor. It's not like, yeah, this is key lime pie. It just tastes kind of like lime. Yeah. Kind of. I mean, it's still good it's as bad, far as consistency, as far as like creaminess. Okay. And, and they're both the same, which is good because they're not like, oh, this one is good, but this one has different consistency. Mm -hmm. They're both creamy. They're both, you know, smooth. They both taste like ice cream. There's no aftertaste. It's just the flavor wasn't there on that one. So maybe if you punch up the lime a little bit, punch up the coconut a little bit, add something to it to make yeah. it have the flavor. <laughs> I mean, because it's not bad. It's just not like, woo! Yeah. Like, when I tasted that <laughs> other one, I was like, wow, that is really, really decadent. That one, yes, I can see yes. you would not eat the whole container of that unless you really, really, really wanted to because that's very decadent. Yeah, but... Nonetheless, I think they're really good. It makes me want to try the other flavors that yeah. this brand has. I love how all these vegan brands are really branching out and developing more like flavors, more options. It's really great. It's a really exciting time to be vegan right now. Uh, I still give this second one two thumbs up. Yeah. Because it's still good. It's delicious. It's not bad. It's so delicious. It's really so delicious. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> so delicious, dude. I think this is actually better than the original So Delicious ice cream. <laughs> yeah, to be honest, I didn't like the original because it had an aftertaste. So I'm really, really, really thankful for this. Now, if, if you guys urge your grocery stores to start stocking this stuff because there's 78,000 different brands of ice cream and one <laughs> vegan brand at, our, at my Kroger's. Yeah. You know, and so, and then it's like one flavor and it looks all old. <laughs> so it's like, I just think with something like this, this is great. It tastes good. If you can get your hands on it, try it. If there's other flavors that you want us to try, let us know and we'll look for them. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, two thumbs up. Everything was good. There was nothing wrong with it. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. Perfection. I think any non-vegan or vegetarian. They wouldn't know the difference. Or meat eater or whatever would not know the difference. In fact, they might like this more because it's, ice cream tends to be really heavy. It's lighter. And it's lighter. It's still fattening. Okay. So, I mean, we're not telling you like, hey, this is a low fat treat because it's not. But it's lighter. It's not sitting on my gut like it did when you were drinking that cow's milk ice cream, you know, or eating that cow's milk ice cream. But I think this would be great in like a, what are those? Shakes? 
Oh yeah, like a, a milkshake, a milkshake or something mm -hmm. uh, for your kids. You can put it on top of pie, like especially the key lime flavor because it's really, really, really light. Yeah, like this one right here would taste really good on some, a pecan top of pie. a pecan pie, on top of like a peach pie, a peach cobbler. <laughs> People in the south are gonna shoot me dead. <laughs> peach cobbler. <laughs> the audacity! What is a peach pie? <laughs> Get a rope. <laughs> I love them. Love, and I don't use that word. You know me, I'm a very tough critic, but these are delicious. Yeah, I'm really just like are... waiting for this like video to end before I can eat this. Okay, because we can't wait. Oh my God, it's so good. You know, I want, that one would be so much better if it tasted like lime. Okay. Mm, really good. Really, really, really good. Oh, hold on, one more. Next up, we did get our hands on the corn dogs. We had to order them. Apparently, three-day shipping at Vegan Essentials is not the same as three-day shipping <laughs> for anywhere else. I think they meant three days to pack it. <laughs> and then three days to mail it. three days to mail it. But we did get our hands on that and some other goodies, so we're excited because we got some stuff that we mm -hmm. have, have being shipped in, and we're going to try that for you guys. And we do hear your comment, uh, JJ, about wanting to, us to like... We're talking to you. <laughs> about wanting us to maybe try cooking the product and are doing something different with it so we have plans for two of the products we're getting that are like an ingredient that would be in something so we are actually going to cook something so stay tuned for that and we're gonna do different takes because i cook different than she does mm -hmm. yeah she's very frou-frou <laughs> and i'm very home style so we, we could but we both cook good it's just different yeah so i'm looking forward to it yeah so if there's anything you guys want us to try and that's on your radar let us know in the comments down below we love your comments yes we love your comments we might not have a whole bunch of followers but the ones who do follow us are awesome they watch all the videos they comment they give us the feedback we only want to get better so um don't forget to share this video give it a thumbs up comment go buy this ice cream not this flavor but the other ones yeah <laughs> go, go buy this ice cream it's this ice cream is fucking good the bomb was the bomb the bomb.com the bomb.com we're so old that's, that was cool when we were young yeah young, young kids don't understand do you guys do you guys remember when you would leave like a message on your phone when people would call like a, it was called an answering machine you would like either sing or rap or do something funny well there's shauna and i had something and I think we should do it. Ready? Well, you just call it. We're not home. We know you wanna talk on the phone, so wait for the beat. You gotta leave your name. You gotta leave your number. Just wait for the beat. Ow! And never ever was the message for us. So my parents <laughs> the message was crazy. It was my dad's work phone. <laughs> But they didn't know. Like we had like, um, it's like when Star 69 and stuff came on. So we got like the voicemail and everything. They didn't know what their message sounded like. They had no idea how to get I don't messages. think they ever knew. So that's cool. <laughs> sorry, mom. Sorry, sorry, dad. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it's really, really, really good. I'm sorry, vegans. You know what I'm talking about. You can't find some good ice cream. This one right her. So, right her. so delicious. Or your southerners. Right her. Right her. <laughs> You do it right there. I'm not putting that in the video for sure. Oh, she won't put her crazy stuff in there, but anything I do is gonna be in there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And also, um, if there's any kind of video you'd like to see us do besides taste testing food, let us know. We are open to anything. And we want to give. Well, not anything. We're not gonna do porn. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see you guys next Thursday. Bye. 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 Oh.